Hey guys, welcome to Five here. I'm Jay by Small Space Engineers, Abandoned Mars or Sam. Hi, I can see your feet. Lovely. Today we're going to the radar tower. Well, well, we're going to the freighter. To oh yeah, the freighter. To salvage sorry. it. We, we decided that we're, we're that we we don't want to take it, but we are going to go and see what components we can take off it. Yeah. We decided that it would take the mammoth far too long to get around this this massive mountain. So we're just gonna use a polar bear and take what components we need. Yeah. Like we, we take like an ore. Like if we find any detector components, that's what we want. We want detector components. This is why we added gyroscope to this thing. Incoming. Oh. Mm. Oh, that was a bounce. Yeah. Mm. Nailed it. I'm that's why we had gyros. Nice, nice landing. <laughs> Thank you. I can drive this thing rather well. Yeah. I can't drive a real car, but gosh darn, I can grab the polar bear. Have you ever actually tried to drive a real car? I have car? indeed, actually, on a few occasions. No, once. I, I, I've, I've done it once. And I did not crash. Yeah, we are currently looking for the car which both me and Oliver will be learning to drive in, so that's going to be fun. Ooh. Because we, we, we keep cars for the long term. Yeah. So, isn't it, wasn't it around the Artemis crash thing? It was... Uh, near, it's like, it, it, in the middle of the Artemis crash out in the radar tower. Where is the radar tower? Uh, do you not see it on the, oh no, you, 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 do you have that GPS? Oh yeah, I see it, but it's to the right of us. Yeah, no, I'm just having to go around the, this wee mountain here. So what you guys don't, as you see, I am, I'm providing first person view. Yes. And Darren's providing third person view. Uh-huh. So apparently, we've got like the environment hostility of this place turned up really high. Yeah, I, I looked at a few sensor logs and apparently there's meteor showers occasionally on this planet, so um, that'll be fun. Oh dear. So, gonna, what, what, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to do this, then we're going to try and do a whole, a whole load of contracts to improve our rep with the companies. And we'll not pick one that's shoving us into space. Because that did not go well. We failed that contract and got so much reputation taken off of us. So we need to get a good, a good easy contract that will gain us yeah. rep. Uh huh. So um, you know, there there is quite a lot of search contracts there. So yeah, like, search contracts. contracts. If you read the details, then I think it might yeah. be more useful. Things like with hauling contracts, they're good because you can find another trading outpost. They're bad because you don't know where they'll go. So. It's a gamble. What in the world is that music? I don't know. It was just a, it's all, it's at the top of my Instagram page. So every time I check, oh. I check my Instagram. It's oh fun. yeah, Sam. Sam like literally do, do, does nothing while we're driving. So yeah, I just I, I just check my Instagram for the reason. Might as well check his Instagram. Go follow him. <laughs> at, I'm not giving that away. So do not. No, do, it's a private. I have a private yes, Instagram account. Uh, I my don't face actually. Up, I like do my not. Face face. I do not. Go follow me on Instagram. I don't know. I'm on just Space that, right? Engineers. Yeah. On your Space Engineers thing, yeah. Yes, I, ha I do have a private one, obviously, which no one will ever know about. We use it. One, right? Also, what you may not know is I may or may not, I'm not sure at this point, but I, I, may, I may have composed the music for this. Um, yeah, we don't know. This. Well, considering that, that this is coming out about, what, five billion years in the future, I think you will have. Yes, um... And also, and um, um, maybe also defend Mars. I'm not sure. Uh, not on escape from Mars because we want to keep consistency. Yeah. With the escape from Mars. There's um, right. something over here, just ahead of us. Can check it out. Yeah. Alright. Is there a plane going over your house? As someone cutting their lawn. I think. Ah. As I slowly move the uh, microphone slightly away. I'll, I'll shut the window. Yeah, you can do that because, again, you're not in any control here. <laughs> yes. Okay, so there's something coming up. It looks yeah, like a radar some, yeah. tower. Oh, there is a lot. There, there's a lot of That's either... That's a base. Yeah, there, there's a lot of either unfinished chunks of the world or a lot of holes. It was, it was just unfinished chunks of the world. Okay. That's a hole. There's a lot of holes around here. Something's happened Oh, here. take a base of action. Okay, might want to slow us out a bit here. Let's see. Yeah, hold on there, looks to be a sign over here. Let's see what's going on. Oh, these are taking damage by the look of it. They're smoking. 
Whoever, whoever they were, just whoever attacked this place yeah. didn't take any prisoners. Soon the There's lights a radar were... tower here of the same design that was up on the hill. So it must be maybe from the same company. Yeah. Oh, here we are. Faction, CBR. They're the combat blockade runners, runners, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Yeah, goblin class starfighters. Yeah, they're, they're down pretty hard. There's a buggy here. And I, oh, Sam, come, come look at this. Oof. So I came down rather hard over here. I'm outside. Was well, anybody in these things? Then they're in. Ah, uh, yeah, come, come look at this one. Oof. Oh. They never did this. They didn't like CBR. They didn't no. like. No. I mean, they, <clears throat> they, 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 they delivered relief supplies. So it's not out of the question to, to assume that a well-organized pirate group did this. It's a frigate. If I remember correctly, a reactor should be in here. Yep, yeah, found a reactor. Oh, it's all... It down. No, I'm just going to ignore that. It's uh, rather snowed in. Let's just... Uh... Has it got any um, stuff in it? No, it's completely... It's it's showing yellow. It's got no power. The, this, this entire base has no power. Hmm. Right, let's continue with the mission. Let me just get off of it. So, let's, let's, cr let's crash... Formerly, formerly crash. What are we now again? Uh, we're the Artemis crash survivors instead of just the crash survivors. The RS. Wee. I just realised we're Ars. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're uh, ACS. Oh, Artemis crash. I don't know why. Why are you going? To, why are you going to the Artemis crash site? I thought we were uh, going to should be over here somewhere. I mean, should we go back and salvage the Artemis? Actually. Oh, good. Her. Yeah. Oh, crater! We don't actually know how damaged that thing is, so it might need some supplies from the Artemis. Yeah, that's my point. Radar tower up there. The Artemis is uh, five kilometers away and closing. We should see it on the horizon. Yep. So. And another crater there. I don't know what's going for. Whatever happened there was a big fight. Yeah, probably meteor sh but that, I, I, I'd be worried about the Artemis if it wasn't already very damaged. Yeah, well, if, 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 it, if it wasn't already you know, plunged into the ground. Yeah, yeah, it's not, it's, it's not getting operational yet. No. We are closing in. Are you still in third person? I'm in third person still, yeah. Still can't see it. Yeah, I know. We're moving in. The horizon is too short. Uh, we're, we're a wee bit off course, I'm fretting. Because it's a sh small yeah. planet. Oh! That class looks familiar. Do you see them? Is that a G-Corp destroyer? They look way too familiar. There's three I thought we destroyed G-Corp on Mars. Uh, that was a year ago. Yeah, and keyword there, on Mars. Oh dear. We should, we should get out of here. Hold on. Well, there looks like they, 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 they've erected a little base wall around it. They must re do you think they recognize us? I wouldn't put it past it. You know, it's a, it's a rather recognizable starship. Yeah. Let's get out of here. We need to take it, though. What are we going to do? There's stuff we, in we, there. We There's never purge anything people. off that. And I'm, I'd be surprised if they haven't seen us right now. They don't, and, and right now, G-Corp doesn't actually know what we look like. No. Well, so we, we haven't exactly changed color scheme, so it probably wouldn't be a tall order to guess. I know, but if they've um, but they don't know exactly, they don't know what you look like. So if they, um, but if they manage to find that on the Artemis, then they can search for people instead of. And they just they they probably searched it and found zero dead bodies and salvage marks. They know so. we're alive, and they know there's no there's no other. Is there any way of getting off this planet? <sighs> if I, I believe until they've had control of it. Uh, I, I built yeah. I'm not sure if they have blockades or anything. I'm not sure how high we jumped in. We, we, we may have jumped only a few kilometers up. I reckon we may have curved through, uh, may have hit that mountain. Possibility, <laughs> definitely, yeah. And that well, would have separated the flight pod. So what are we going to do about that? We can't let them get too much information from We could build a strike craft. We could. Right, salvage we what we can. Check, check the containers first. We're not fixing it. No. D detect, oh, yeah. detect the components, I have detected components. That, they're useful, let's use, we'll keep those. Take everything, everything. Nothing Just remains. Oh, I've got some thruster components here. Nice. Nothing remains, take everything. 
A lot of clips. Check, check, check the one at the end there. There's a lot of clips and there's a lot of uh, components in there. I'm just gonna check all the connected inventories. Well, this costs a load of steel plates. And Take stuff. everything. I think that, that we can. I can't fit it all in my inventory. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, dr drop it off and then come back for it. Whew, we, we, we're we getting quite a few solar cells. That's good. This is gonna get us... Are you sure we want to get on G Corp's radar? In fact, we are already on G Corp's radar. I was gonna so. say, uh, I'm pretty sure we're already heavily on that radar. And now they know we're here. Um, there's a there's a there's a welder in there. Should I just leave that? I take it. We can uh, de decompose it. Sorry, deconstruct. Just try to pick up everything I can before I go back to yeah. the thing and dump it all off. We should have brought the mammoth. It, it could have held so much more. Yeah, but again. But, and also, but the mammoth would have been seen, I suppose. Yeah, that would have been spotted instantly and probably engaged. Especially since it has our colours. Yeah, it's not, and it has, you know, that massive gun which does pose a huge threat to G Corp. Well, could have taken. So, what are we going to do? How are we going to fight? I, I don't think a single strike craft can be able to. Uh, be able well, to the weather on this planet, right? Take them, like, if we wait until the snows, it's at, at, at its, uh, like, you know, in a massive, you know, hailstorm, basically. It, well, last time it basically messed up all our sensors, communication, and especially eyesight. So we should be, so you're just trying to think we can sneak past them? I think we can sneak past them and covertly take out their destroyers. We just have to move everything from this, this, this uh, cargo container. So take out this, what do you mean, like, board one or? No, blow it to pieces. Uh, yeah, but if we blow it, yeah, but how are we going to blow them to pieces with, this, like, with like a single strike craft? Come look in this cargo container I'm standing at right now, you'll uh, see what I have planned. Just uh, come look here. Are you, get, are you adding rocket launchers? Of course we're going to add, add rocket launchers, but just look in that container, you'll see what I mean. Oh, missiles. Nope. It's something a wee bit more powerful. Explosives. Yep. We could have planned bombs. Oh, yes. Well, you're right, I'm taking out that one, I'll take this other one. Cool. Um, let's see. We're going to plant explosives on board. How or maybe we just go for... Or what we could maybe do is just, you know, make a dash with a strike crap. Oh, 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 or what we could do... They make a two-man strike craft. Ooh, I like the sound of that. You know, if, if we have a two-man strike craft, then maybe what we could possibly do is sneak past, still undetected, it's still small enough, I believe, to get past. Mm. Note the words I believe are not very encouraging. I believe a two-man strike craft could get through. So how do we do it? You fly, I shoot her. Yeah. And then what we could do is, you know, what one of us just quickly jump out, mm -hmm. you know, plant a bomb, and run like hell. Okay. Um, I've, I've not, I've not managed to empty everything yet. Hang on. Yeah, I know. I, I say we, we, though, we should probably consider getting out of here. I've that. almost got it, Darren. Right. Okay. And, and we've got to have something to do before while well, well, we. Well, while we wait for the storm to come. Cause yeah, it's not but remember, particular... we don't actually have the fighter yet. Yeah, I suppose. The flight scene, that's fine. Do you want to build the fighter? Or... Probably a good idea. Alright, so how are we going to set up these guns and stuff? Are we going to have like, a person inside operating the turrets? Yeah, I'll figure something out, right. We, we, need, we, we need to get back, back to space rather quickly. Let's go. Hang on a sec, just let me, let, let me drop off all the stuff I have in my inventory. Alright, fill, fill, fill up your inventory and that's your lot. Trip. Alright, I'll fill up the grab my though. So, are we, we going to take the mammoth over here and keep it out of sight, though? No, we're going to leave the mammoth over there, I think. But why are we going back to base, then? Why don't we just stay here? Because all of our materials are there, and we're out of range of G-Corp. Alright, well, I've kind of, um, I've, I've got stuff in my, I've... I've it's fine, just, there's just still stuff in there, but we'll be coming back, so it's yeah. fine. Wait, wait hop for in, me! Hop in. Wait for me! Hop in, we're going slow, just hop in. I'm in. Nice, let's go. So we swap places, shall I? In fact, no, you're driving, so you use the person. I'm driving. So head back to the mammoth. Yeah. Uh, do you know where we're going? Yeah, I, I have a GPS, the mammoth is currently broadcasting. Oh, I see it, yeah. 
It's, you know, 18 kilometers away from G Corp. Yes, please. I'm back on the Instagram. I can hear it. Copyright music. <laughs> You know, this is the best part of it, this game, the entire game, you know? Yeah. We're going, we're going rather fast. Try not to smack into anything. Well, we are quite far away from the uh, mammoth. Yeah, but that's kind of the point of this, though. So, I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna take a risk. I'm, I'm gonna take a risk. What do you think they're doing over there right now? I have no idea. They're probably just trying to, you know, pick up any trace of us that, that they can. I wouldn't be surprised if they have a wee bit of a grudge against us. Well, we did, like, we, we did almost single-handedly take them out. I mean, exactly. we barely did anything. Well, actually, they did distract us. They took out a lot more of their fleet than we did, so... Be quiet. <laughs> we got the information. We were a rather large threat. And we disabled their bomb. Or at least we're not helped in it. That. And if they're already taking out UFI, or maybe UFI don't, don't, don't even know that, that they're still here. I think, yeah, think they're gone. They definitely don't care about us. We were just think we were just a I mean, we did. I mean, they might have cared about us. We'll never know. Cause that was a year ago. Any search party that was sent out for us, which I do believe that there probably was, would have been called off by now. Yeah, well, we were, well, we were nowhere in that year. We I don't, I don't even year. know where we were. We were traveling. Basically. Well, actually, we don't know how long we were sitting on that lake before we woke up. Yeah, I know. Honestly, we, we probably could have. Actually, no, I think what has, again, uh, do you remember that experiment I told you about that UFI did? Oh, yeah, that. Yeah. If, if we were sitting on that ice lake, it wasn't for too long. Mm -hmm. But I don't think we, it was cold enough for us to be, for, to keep for, us alive. Yeah. Cold enough, to be honest. Or if we were there, does we the, were... Does the Artemis have central heating? Nope. Mm -hmm. We were pretty cool. I mean, there, we were on Mars and we had space suits, so I didn't think it was necessary. Central heating. We did have air conditioning, though. Like, Darren, are you trying to get us destroyed? No. I haven't destroyed us yet. I don't think. I see, we're fine. For now. Is there any damage to us? Nope, not a single scratch. Hello, engineer. My name is Goodbot. Oh, I don't hear really your name is Goodbot. You've been coming at me since the very first... Is there any way to disable it, Goodbot? I don't, I, I don't know. I, I just passed it. <laughs> oh, well, that's I... a rather large cliff. Yeah, don't go off the rather large cliff. Great kid, don't get cocky, I believe in the right words. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Great kid, I don't get cocky. What was that, sir? As you fly off a cliff for the fun of it. Whee! Whee! I got cocky! <laughs> yeah, I've started watching Clone Wars Season 7. Ooh, you're finally catching up. I mean, I watched the final, like, what would it be, on Monday at, like, midnight? Because that's when it came out. You watched it. As soon as possible. Exactly. I'll, I'll probably, I'll probably w easily one of the first people to ever watch it. So. <laughs> I think I said. I think we got a bit of air, sir. Are we? Are, did we? Are we still falling? Yep. Mm. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh. oh. Fine. <sighs> I built this thing well. <clears throat> Trust me, I'm a whale biologist. Are you? No, but I'm trying to sound really, 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 uh, um, not comforting. <laughs> Trust me, I'm a whale biologist. So why are we driving a thing you make? I don't know, you, you got in the car, you tell me. Well, you build better than I do. 
That was proof from the build versus. Are we going to do that again, by the way, the build versus? Thing? Good. Oh, then I, we've, we've taken a slight dent. That's all the damage we've taken so far. We're about... Uh, are we dead on the front? You know, just, just a wee ding. On the underneath of the front? Right. No, just on the uh, ram. Just, they're, on they're the ram. wee ding. I'm, I don't see it. What, one of the uh, bottom slopes is slightly dented. We, we, we probably just scraped. We've we, we got some I, I air again. See it. It's all right. It's fine. Oof. It's fine. This thing's built for I just accidentally got out. Got out. Why did I get out? Nice, nice job. We're going to get a slight bit more air. Whee! I see the mammoth. It's rather large. Yeah, it's it's kind of hard to miss when you can when it's a... Oh. Mm. Oh, there's a I jump can't... and a half. I... You know why I like abandoned Mars? Why? We're kind of starting it from the beginning. Yeah, we know? are. Up like, we go! In, uh, I've damaged the ram pretty badly. Mm. Yeah, because in... Yes, in... in the Incoming! Boink. Mm. I think you just damaged us again. Yep, the ram's rather damaged. We're gonna... Was that an explosion over there? No, maybe, I don't know. If it, if it was, not an explosion the microphone. Oh, well, great. <laughs> just to the right, there were explosions. Oh, fantastic. I didn't see them. That hole's very, very close. Yeah, yeah. Are, are you just going to leave it out or are we going to... Yeah, it might as well just leave it out. Oh my goodness. L look how close this, the, the, these holes are. These, what holes are? Look at some of these holes that are around the place. These, these were not here when, when, when we set out, were they? Look. No, something's happened. Yeah, it's probably, probably one of those meteor showers I was talking about. Has anything hit the mammoth? Nope, we're seem to be fine. Damage reports 100%. Alright, so we, um, do you want to fix up the ram on the polar bear? Uh, I say that, that we just, you know, go right into trying try, try to build that strike craft. We can't afford to waste time with G-Corp, so, well, obviously add our stuff. Yes, we're not going to bring up and bring the mammoth up against the net. We need no. to weaponize the mammoth more before we're ready for that. I don't think we can. Th this is enough to do something, but, you know. By the way, I feel like we should fix up the doors and finish the set, finish this. We don't have this, enough. What this we're, really, we're, kind of, we're kind of living hands We only need small steel tubes and girders. Yeah. For this one, we only need small steel Fair. tubes. Right, guys, so that, that's been this episode. Next episode, we're going to start building that strike craft. So, yeah, have a good one, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. I'm going to stop recording. All right, um, can I just like, finish this off and